what's going on guys clay here back with another youtube video today's video will be going over a tier list of all the maps in black ops cold war before we get into the video if you could hit that sub button and also hit that like button today's like goal is 35 likes so if you could do that for me i'd really appreciate it for this first map america i would probably put this in c and that's because the spawns are really bad on this map especially when playing domination someone can literally spawn right on top of you and if a map is bad with spawns i don't normally like to play it a lot apocalypse i don't i don't have that many videos uploaded on this map but whenever i have played it it's been pretty good i'd probably put this in c with america marta strike is a map i've never gotten in rotation but whenever i played it on 12v12 i absolutely hated it it was too big of a map in my opinion cartel is way better of a map for 12v12 i would probably put armada strike in f could just by the simple fact that i don't play it at all now with cartel like i just said it's probably my favorite 12v12 map but if i was to play it on 6v6 i absolutely hated the grass is way too tall you can barely even see anything so just for that simple fact that i play 6v6 now i'd probably put it in d it's just not that fun of a map for me. Now for Checkmate, it's a great hardpoint map. I love playing it in league play. I'd probably put this at the top of C. Now Collateral Strike, I've been getting this map a lot more recently. And I'm starting to grow with it and learn the spawns and stuff. I'd probably put this in B. It's pretty, pretty fun so far, so I don't have no complaints over it. Now for Crossroads Strike, I don't have a problem with this map. But if we're going for a 12v12, the Crossroads map how big of a map it was there was just filled with snipers i absolutely hated it in 12v12 when the game first came out but for this map hardpoint isn't that bad and i'd probably put it in the back of c right now for right now e program i just recently started playing it too like i don't really enjoy this map people like to camp at the top i don't know what that area is called but i just hate it i'd put it in d now for diesel this is another map i don't get that much but whenever i do get it i enjoy this map so much i'd put it in b with collateral strike now with drive-in i get it a lot but i always back out whenever i see this map because i for some reason everybody just wants to vote for this but i hate playing on this map it's kind of like cartel for me i put it in d now with echelon i was not really a fan of this map whenever they first introduced it but i've been practicing on it and getting better and i love this i every time i get it i always stay in the lobby i'd probably put this in b with diesel and collateral strike now for express it's a very iconic map it's been in it was in black ops 2 and i loved it and i still love playing on it i just wish it there was more people on like 8v8 or instead of 6v6 because 6v6 is just too slow for me but i'd put it in a so now for garrison my opinion this map is amazing for hardpoint but terrible 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 on domination that's just my opinion i'd probably have to put it in c it's a great competitive map but i just don't really enjoy it playing on it very much hijacked is a very iconic map it's been around since bo2 i loved it and i still love it now i'd have to put it in a with express miami strike Miami is a terrible map. I'm glad I don't have it on here. It is so bad. This map is all right. I just feel like it's too crowded when it comes to trying to get B on domination. I'd have to put it in C. I don't really enjoy it that much. Miami, a terrible map. I don't have much to say. F, in my opinion. Moscow, great on hard point. I don't really like it on Dom. I just feel like there's too many places to camp. I'd put it in C. Nuketown, very iconic map. It's been around since Black Ops 1. I love it. In my opinion, this one is probably the worst one. So I'm going to put it in A. But I love Nuketown regardless. Raid is another one of those like, iconic maps. I love it. I'm going to put this one in S. It's been my favorite map of all time. Besides Firing Range, but we don't have Firing Range in Cold War. I really wish they would have remastered it, but I don't think we're going to get it. I really enjoyed satellite whenever it first came out i don't really enjoy it that much now and i barely even get it in my rotations but whenever i do play it i try to play a little bit slower than what i'm normally used to i put it in c along with these slums has been around since black ops 2 it's another remastered map that i absolutely enjoy i'm gonna put this one in s it's one of my favorite maps to play on 
Next on the list, we have Standoff. This is a great map to play on. I really like playing S and D on this map whenever I'm not recording or anything. I just want to have fun. It didn't have that many windows. I'd probably put it in S, but I think I'm going to have to put it in A. Just for the simple fact that too many places that you can be looked at, it's just not that fun to me. The Pines, it's too big of a map. I like re the really, really small maps. In 6v6, I feel like they did this map wrong. They could have had it on 12v12 or maybe like a 10v10 mode or something like that. I'd put it in D. It's too big of a map. WMD is an old map that they just released recently. I didn't really like it on here, but if you took me back to Black Ops 1, I would have played it all day long. I'd probably put it in B. I don't really know how to say this map, but don't butcher me. I think it's Yamatu or Yamatu. I don't personally like this map. I'm going to have to put it in C. I don't really have much to say because I don't play it that much. Whenever I do play it, it's just not that fun to me. Zoo is just another one of those maps I don't really like playing. And whenever I do play it, I usually back out because I just don't have fun. Too many. It's too big for me. I wish it was like AV8 or 10v10. I'm going to put it in F. So this is my tier list for all the maps. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what y'all's. So this is my tier list for all the maps in Cold War. Let me know what y'all's tier list would look like down below in the comments. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit that like button and I'll see you in the next one. Chokey beef.